Coming to the industrial XP, industrial XP is all about XP in the industrial environment, big organization, large organization. So the precursor of knowing industrial XP is that you must know the XP. What is extreme programming under agile software development? Okay. So everything is same as XP, the different phases we talked about. In industrial XP, there are slight changes. It was uh, actually described by Joshua and he described the industrial extreme programming, a type of agile software development. And one he said, you know, there are big companies, Adobe and Google and etc. The big organization, how to implement this XP, what, what uh, changes or what things we should know, know. So he said, Joshua, that XP is just an organic evolution of XP, right? It is along with XP because XP is all about minimalistic, customer centric, test driven spirit. We already talked about XP. So this is also a kind of, you know, a, a layering for industrial. I XP, because here we are including management more and the customer and everyone has to be on board and the technical practices has to be upgraded. So I XP is incorporating, encompassing six uh, new practices for big organization. So as I said, you need to know XP to understand this. This is a, uh, Everything is XP only with the uh, industrial aspects here. The first thing is readiness assessment. That is the IXP team. As I said, everyone has to be on board. It can be stakeholder, developer, management. Everyone has to be on board. And one more important thing is what skill they have, the skill levels we have, we need for this project to complete. The project community that we need right people. That is everyone's skill will be different. And if the skill is not there, we have to train them. If a hardware, hardware, software, uh, hardware person is there, uh, he can design FPG and etc. But if you say him to make a software, he won't be able to do it. Okay. So the right skill and training is important. Then comes the project chartering. Now let us talk about Google or say Adobe. Now if they have taken certain software, first they have to think whether this, uh, this software, what we are making or the application we are making, whether it is justifying our organization, the goals and objective, the mission and mode of our organization. This is project chartering, right? Coming to test driven management. As I said, every point, every uh, destination or milestone will be there that we need to check whatever the software is coming to us. Software increment, we have to check. And this is all about testing. You know, we have talked about testing and we'll be talking about uh, testing uh, in the later discussion. This is called as uh, retrospective. So this is kind of a, say, technical review, technical review. The, the term here we are using in industrial XP is retrospective when the software uh, increment is delivered. And then the continuous learning. We have to make the, the team aware of the latest technologies. We have to guide them. We have to teach them to be, you know, at par with the present scenario.